everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, today I'm doing just a little 14 by 14 canvas. I'm gonna do uh, an experiment with the swipe technique. Um, a lot of times what I've done with the swipe is I've started on one side of the canvas, put my cell activator on the palette knife, and I just swipe through all of the colors. And what happens is when I get to the end, everything starts to get muddy because the cell activator, I've run out of it. And so it's just left with remnants of the cell activator running through the colors. So then you end up tilting that side off and stuff like that. So today what I wanna do is I'm gonna do multiple swipes, but I'm gonna keep the swipes very short. That way I'm using the cell activator on the back of the palette knife and I'm stopping before I run out. Then I'll scrape the palette knife, load up more cell activator, and then I'll start re-swiping in another little section. So I'm gonna do small sections and see if the colors maintain their bright and vibrant and, and just looking really, really pretty on the canvas. So I think that's gonna really render a really cool looking um, composition and keeping the colors the way I want them. So let's get down on the canvas and let's get started. I'll be right back. Hey guys, so I'm back for a little quick video and I'm just gonna do a little swiping with the uh, Australian Floetrol and Oxide Black from Amsterdam. So the colors I'm gonna use today is the Pebeo's uh, Violet Blue mixed with a little per uh, permanent magenta um, from Amsterdam, a little phthalo blue, and some aqua green from um, Liquitex and some 24K gold. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna lay out a puddle of white and I'm gonna zigzag the colors on and then I'm gonna swipe through. Now I'm gonna try a little experiment today because what I notice sometimes is when I'm swiping with my Australian Floetrol in black, it gets great cells in the beginning, middle, and then it starts to fizzle out at the end. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go just one little swipe and stop. And then I'm gonna do another, I'm gonna load up my flow draw, um, load up my palette knife again with the uh, color black oxide and flo uh, Aussie flow draw. And I'm gonna swipe back through it again. That way each section will get its own bright cells. Now, let's see if this actually works. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to be using my white. This is also, this is uh, Artist Loft Soft Body White. Um, what I want to do is, let's do this. It's going to have plenty of paint on here. And I'm going to spin this on my little spinner. I think I'm going to have enough white. We'll see. I'm gonna put my blue down first. What I would like to do is start off here on the edge. And then I'm gonna put the turquoise green Kind of zigzagging it over the blue. Gold on top of those. And my magenta. That's a lot of paint on there, and that's okay. So then I'm gonna swipe up this way and stop. And then I'm gonna re-put, load up my palette knife and swipe through again. I'm gonna press lightly on the edge here. And stop. See, I got some nice, bright, vibrant colors there. That's exactly what I wanted. Now I'm gonna swipe through here again after I load up my palette knife. I'm 
just gonna pick it up right here, pressing. I'm gonna lift up. And then I'm gonna do the last swipe there. Lightly press. Smear it right off. Now I'm just gonna let the Australian float trawl do its thing. I'm not gonna put any more white down because I think I've got enough. Um, may need just a little bit on this side. All right, give us a little spin. this over here and now I'm just gonna bring this down I'm gonna put a bit more there just to help it out. This way, back. corner. Go. That's pretty wild. So this as an experiment on breaking up the cell activator and doing it all over the painting, that is a big plus. All right guys, here we are. Love these colors together. And again, swiping in smaller sections really makes all of the colors be more vibrant. Look at that. Ooh, look at that little pink one right there in the center. That's cool. All right, and I might have to turn this different direction for composition, but we'll see when it's dry. I'll be right back. All right, here we are with the dried result. This is so beautiful and the experiment worked. I'm gonna start doing half swipes with my cell activator. That way each color stays vibrant and I don't start to get muddiness towards the end of the swipe. Look at how all of the colors stay nice and vibrant. There's no muddiness.
All right, guys, that's going to do it. So this was a success. And sorry for the glare. I went ahead and put one coat of resin on this. I'm going to have to put a second coat because I can see the, the edge of the canvas around here. It's got, it's, it, you know, the, the, because these canvases are so small, they even spraying them and making them nice and taut, um, it, it still has a little bit of an angle to it. So I'll have to put another coat of resin, but I'll make sure I'll really concentrate around the edges. But overall, look at that. And again, sorry for the glare, because that's the resin. But look at the colors. They stayed super vibrant. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love playing with the swipe technique. It's just a really cool technique. All right, guys. So um, I'm going to use these colors in another painting. I think I might do an open cup pour with those colors. We'll see how that goes. So, All right, everyone. Thanks for tuning in. Sorry I couldn't be with you today, but I am flying. If I've got Wi-Fi on the plane, I will pop into the premiere. If I can't, I do apologize. So everybody, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. That'll let you know when I do post new video content. Everyone, have a great day. Enjoy the rest of the week. Bye-bye.